example of really extreme integration on Windows 7, you have to look no further than the brand new version of Microsoft Surface. Microsoft Surface is announced today. This is a brand new version, and if you remember from the first version, you notice there's some pretty stark differences from version one of Surface PC. We worked hand-to-hand -hand with Samsung on the entire end-to-end -end experience I'm about to show you. The first thing to notice is that the PC is thin. No longer is it a big box with the cameras inside. This is only four inches thin. Inside here, there's a full power Windows 7 PC. It's got a dual core CPU and a GPU from AMD. Up top, this is the biggest piece of Gorilla Glass that has ever been bonded to an LCD ever. But what's really amazing about this technology, what really makes it magical, is the sensor itself. So those first generation Surface PCs needed cameras underneath that would look up to try to see what was going on. But what we have here is called Pixel Sense. Pixel Sense is new technology we've invented where there's infrared sensors all across the screen. Every single pixel is actually acting as a camera. The PC, the surface here can actually see. So I'm holding up a piece of paper that says I can see, and when I set it down, what you see on this debug monitor and what you can see in the split screen above is that the PC can actually see that paper. So this is even beyond touch. And Pixel Sense is more than just vision, it's actually the processing inside that takes that data and makes it available for developers to write cool applications on it. One of the really cool things about this new thinner form factor is it no longer has to just be a table. You can also use Surface as a kiosk. And I want to talk a little bit about the Royal Bank of Canada. This is one of our launch partners that is going to be putting these Surface PCs in public. These are ruggedized PCs. This thing is designed for industrial commercial application. In fact, if you go across the street to Hard Rock Cafe, you can see some of the Generation 1 Surfaces in use there in the bar. They can take the impact of a beer bottle dropping from 18 inches onto the screen without breaking, and even the fluid will run off properly. But do not tell them I sent you over there to try that. Here's, here's an example of an application that would be up in the bank. The Royal Bank of Canada sends these flyers to thousands of potential customers, and when they take the flyer into the bank, they just show it to the screen, and Surface recognizes the flyer. It can see the flyer and enter you into this drawing and see whether you've won. And that's the power of Pixel Sense technology. Vision-based interaction creates a whole new category of applications that developers can write. You can see in this case I've won, which always happens in my demo. And when I close this, I can interact with some of the other applications that the bank might have to show up some of the products and services services that they would have for customers. So here's an example of modeling how their savings products would work. So I save $5 a day, I get a little more realistic interest rate and save it for 20 years and see how it accumulates. So with the new lower price, the smaller size, the more versatile form factor, I think you're going to see Surface PC in a lot of cool places in the next year or two. So Steve, if you want to come back out, you can uh, take a look at what it looks like to have 20 fingers on the screen at the same time here. I like this. this you got 10, cool. I got 10. There we go. Thanks. Great. Thanks.